Here we go. Got to put in the 220 circuit, a new one in this box. I already started taking out, taking it apart a little bit. I got to take this all down here because I plan on running the outlet right about there somewhere. But this is what happens, you know. It's the plasma cutter I got. It's, I don't know, we'll check it out. We got a good deal on it. And, uh, Uh, knock something over over here. So much stuff up here now. But uh, especially knock over the plasma cutter, eh? That's it right there. It's a uh, 220 volt plasma cutter. Uh, it's supposedly a Pro Series uh, plasma 375, and. Uh, well, uh, kind of overwhelming right now. It's kind of, it's not too bad of a day out here. But, uh, got all the power shut off, so that means no fans. And that means, uh, I don't know what I'm going to do for heat until I get that done. And hopefully, uh, I can get this accomplished before it gets too dark. But, uh, hey, this is, uh, what happens when you uh, don't come out here for a while? Things just pile up. and That's alright. Give me something to do today. I'm looking forward to getting that taken care of today. But I have to go in the house and prepare dinner now. So I'll be back. Well, we're still at it out here. Of course, I didn't get right back to you. I had other jobs that I want to take care of before I started filming anything. I got uh, half the electricity on in the garage. But, uh, I don't know if you can see that. Oh yeah, you can see that. But I had to tear this wall up a little bit. Right now I'm working on the plug. I'm trying to get the plug together. And, uh, still at it. Well, there's my cord, all the power's on, and uh, I don't have no way of testing the 220, I don't have a meter for that, but I'm sure it's charged, and uh, that's my air compressor, and that's going to be the uh, plasma cutter. I got full power in the garage. That's a good thing. Oh my goodness. This will all be tomorrow. Just wanted to show you guys I'm getting better. Thanks to you guys out there for wishing me well. I feel much better today. Thank you. I uh, just wanted to show my face to you guys. Show you guys that I'm doing much better. At least uh, I'm looking better anyway. I think I'm looking better. But yeah, I'll show you what's look even looking much better. Say hello to Miss Mo Power. I know you had not seen her in a while. So there she is. Oh yeah. And uh, let me get the uh, sticker board lit up. You gotta light up the sticker board. There we go. Wanna say hi to all you guys. Thanks for all you guys do out there, for everybody out there in the garage gang. You guys are more than helpful. Anybody ever got a question, I'll tell you, they're willing to help you out. I had questions on this, and I'll tell you, you guys are just great. Uh, I can't remember. Oh, well, anyways, I've, I'll come up with his name a little bit later on, and I'll give him thanks for, for credit to do. All right, guys, I guess that's it for today. So all I want to say is, have a good day today, and a better day tomorrow. Later. Well, easy. I just want to let you know that, uh, you know how we get these spotless garages. All we got to do is do one job out here, no matter what it is, and it's back to total chaos. But, uh, yeah, see what happens? You know what happens.
I bet you yours isn't exactly as neat as it was tearing apart those transmissions. Uh, making you guys dizzy. And here's the accessories. I think it's a 10 foot ground cable. No, it's not. I think it's a 5 foot. I think it's a 10 foot uh, torch. Whatever you call them. And let's see here. Power. Yeah, on the back side. Air inlet. Goes up to uh, 40 amps. Okay, well, 